other coaches um, that had an influence um, on not only who you are as a coach, but um, as a man. How about Ward Piggy Lambert, coach? He had a had a profound influence on your basketball philosophy, didn't he? Yes, and I'd say in other things. He was a, a wonderful person, a um, man of very, very extremely high principles. I might say that uh, that uh, I believe it was in 1949 for the first NCAA tournament. Uh, Purdue won the Big Ten and were invited, and he wouldn't go because he didn't think that intercollegiate athletics should be played in places like Madison Square Garden. Indiana University finished second in the Big Ten once, and they won their national championship. But he stuck up for the things that he believed very much. Uh, was a competitor, a spirited competitor. Uh, and I lots, thought so much from him. I think maybe the heart of my pyramid, uh, as the years went by, uh, it was he was indirectly uh, responsible to things. Uh, condition, trying to get the uh, youngsters in the best possible condition. Um, uh, skill, teach them not only um, uh, properly but quickly execute the fundamentals. And third, they must play together as a team. Team spirit was the third thing. They're the heart of the pyramid and not realizing at the time, I think at the time I was developing that, it's probably from his influence uh, without my uh, realizing it at the particular time.